Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Um, if you don't know who I am, I'm Nilsi No. I'm a multimedia production student um, and I like to do a lot of gaming. So today we're going to be playing the new Sims 4 pack. Um, I know it's been a hot minute since they've actually released it, but you know, being a student really sucks sometimes. <laughs> we're gonna play the new Paranormal Stuff pack and I'm gonna do an honest review of it. I have specifically made sure that I haven't really watched anything other than um, when EA actually did their live stream of it, and that's about it. Okay, sorry. OBS is taking its time. <laughs> Five hours later. Hey friends, so it is now a, um, almost the fifth hour of technical difficulties and I have finally managed to fix them. And um, so I'm going to do like a voiceover type thing this time because um, I'm not sure how else to do it. Oh my gosh, if you want to survive, I feel like this is, is a lot more dramatic than a lot of their other packs. Um, I'm gonna make a new game. What is this? This must be the paranormal stuff pack. Ooh, these outfits. Girl. Such style. I like these. Ooh. Let's see what the hairstyles bring up. Okay, so they did add a couple. Um, let's try some of these out. Ooh, that looks really nice on you. That just looks really weird with the hat. Don't get me wrong, I like it, but it doesn't show the whole hairstyle. We can always change it later. Okay, I like that. We'll go with that. Are we gonna have like a date with the ghosts or something like that? Gives me like an old timey vibe. I don't know why, but it does. <laughs> Let's see what our outfits have for this one. Probably nothing. I mean, I I would think that they uh -huh. have something. You gotta run from ghosts at some time, right? Especially if there's really mean ones. Oh. The party one. Wait. I like that one. That was so cool. Ooh. Guess it depends what kind of party it is. Like if you got a nighttime, you gotta have the darker colors, right? <laughs> that yeah, was cool. Man. I love that. Yeah. Oh, there's new shoes. Cool shoes. I these don't really strike me as ghost running detective shoes. Now let's go into our personality traits. Um did it bring up any athletic? Huh. Okay. Uh, so this doesn't have any. This doesn't bring up any. Um, what? There's no new aspirations? Why wouldn't it bring up a new aspiration? That's my question. Okay, I guess we'll just go with knowledge. Hmm. Did it at least give them new traits? No. Okay, um... I'm just gonna randomly select some. Which one is the scary part of town? I feel like Oasis would be more scary. Because a lot of things happen in the desert, I guess. Now... Now we have to go buy some house. Ooh. 
This is really pretty. Holy mackerel. This is so pretty. I'm really bad at building homes. Like, really, really bad. <laughs> this is gorgeous. Simoy Mba. Oh, look. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I like that. Just a casual conversation with some dead people. <laughs> I like that. That's pretty funny. Dabishi. Like, the decorations are so pretty. I absolutely love this. I remember when they were on the live stream, The Sims team, um, they were talking about somebody who made this. I'm not sure who actually made it. I don't remember the name. But, um, wow, fantastic job. These are amazing. I've actually, I've never seen these. But I, it's been a while since I've actually built anything in The Sims. What is that? Is that Kelplet? Oh my god. What the? <laughs> we can name it Mini Simsy. Oh my gosh. Oh, Kayla. <laughs> Mini Simsy. Yes, we're we're gonna leave that. I like that. That's pretty funny. Ooh, the ball. It moves. That animation. I like that. place it's really pretty is there like haunted toilets okay so here's dearly departed see I like reading all of the little stories on here it's it's um oh here they are Palm <laughs> Reader's Tree. <laughs> That's pretty good. Ooh, I like this painting. Let's buy this really expensive painting. Put it on a wall somewhere. Ooh, not. Yeah, I guess we'll just put it right there. Great idea. Okay, let's put it upstairs. Or not. Put it in a bedroom. <laughs> Make it scary. Or not. That works. Um. <laughs> uh, I want you to be the paranormal <laughs> investigator. So let's do that. I don't remember how you do that. I think you have to be like level, what is it, five or something? <gasps> Ghost jerks! <laughs> what was your first guess, honey? Sorry, no offense, ghosts. No, who is this walking around in a full on gown? Only Bella Goth. Only Bella Goth. Literally, only Bella Goth. We have to go say hi now. Cause girl, yes, I wish I could do this, honestly. Yas, please tell me this is Belagoth and this is not me being really completely stupid. I was right, it is Belagoth, it's been a while. I never really um, followed the whole characterization thing. I never really cared, I was just like, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna play my Sims. But girl. <laughs> Which Hollywood Maybe are you on your way to? Zerf. Flan-eyed Baruda. Wolfie. Stop Keep Finn. 
Shall Bo Barleen. Well. The Navy. <laughs> An intelligence researcher at SIMS. You're clever. Super clever. Super clever. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Bruh, I love this. <laughs> oh my god, your sense of style. What? Okay, that is creepy. That is super creepy. I wish I lived in the time of smartphones. They look cool. I used to have a barrel I would play in. Okay. Ever since I heard, uh, who was it, Plumbella, talking about Bone Hilda, I was like, I must find this Bone Hilda person. Okay, this is Bone Hilda. Oh, you does she have a <laughs> why doesn't she have a bone voice why doesn't she just make bone sounds <laughs> let's do a friendly interaction we must be nice to bone hilda uneasy presence otherworldly guidance stranger what oh I Offer soul? <sighs> Why does Bone Hilda have that that voice? I kind of terrified. <laughs> nope. <laughs> it just says nope. Here, what happens if you offer soul? I wonder what happens when you offer soul. <laughs> Only. What is this? I wonder what happens when you drink it. I'm probably gonna kill my sim or something stupid. Oof. Uh, he's probably like, grow some soul. <laughs> grow some soul! Let's hope it doesn't kill her. We can sell that too. Thanks, Bone Hilda. Let's let's say friendly inter introduction. Yo, Bone Hilda. That neighbor. Okay, so so. They naturally, what they do is they just go and add reverb to her voice, so it sounds like she's um, from otherworldly. But why wouldn't you just make some more bony sounds? <laughs> Sorry, but reverb doesn't cut it, honey. Serga blue. Serga blue. Are you flirting? <laughs> Oh Bobby. my word! <laughs> Bone Hilda! You naughty vixen! <laughs> oh my word! Oh, okay. What is this? This <gasps> this looks cool. That does look really cool, actually. I'm sad because I offered some of my soul. <laughs> uh, results may vary. What the balls? What the balls? Did anybody just see that? She just turned into a red-headed person. Is that what Bone Hilda looks like when she's not a bone? What? She drinks a lot of water for somebody with, you know, no stomach. She's funny just to watch, like, look at this hell. This hell's. Look at this hell's. Uh, I'm dying. How does she magically just... 
Chicken nugget. <laughs> chicken nugget. <laughs> Eat the chicken nugget. You're fine. Okay. Nine hours? Ooh. That's it? Okay. You. One. Are you? <laughs> that? Yes, girl. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm just dying. Bella Hilda. Girl. Huh. Yes. Please. Please. <laughs> okay, I specifically clicked Haunted Residential. Don't know why it's still not showing up as a Haunted Residential. Oh, okay, I was like, <laughs> isn't this house supposed to be a little bit more scary? I remember them be being, um, more scared than, um, terrified. Okay. That would explain why before it was saying, it's not really that haunted. <laughs> Mom, mysterious circles. Wait, don't do it. Don't do it! <laughs> what the? Why am I able to edit this? Ooh, finally! Okay, it looks like you can use some help with this whole haunted house person. Oh. oh, hi, Godry. I'm taking a bath. How does this not engage the Maladay. privacy <laughs> thing? Like, yeah. how do you not get embarrassed from Memlet? that? Memlet? Kiarva's. I want to become a paranormal yeah. investigator. Puffy blip for- Whoa, I knew there was something special about you. Yay! Oh. <sighs> okay, so now I am already registered as a freelancer. All I need to do- Ah! Huh. Let's try this. When was the job? 9.30 on Friday. Okay. We'll just speed ahead to that. Yes. Okay. Ooh, yay! I'm so glad I actually get to experience this with my sim. Okay. It's 6.30 a.m. <sighs> the term bar's bar. Uh-huh. Ah. Narimo, Ubene. Very annoying. Or a bay. Throwless Yaba. Huh. Dabishi Taru. see if there's a really whoa okay I want to see if there's a really hard one that I can try um let's see if I can get a really hard gig check for gigs um let's try this and when is my next job 30 on Saturday okay I actually find these kind of cute. <laughs> Is that wrong? That I find them kind of cute? What is that sound? Oh. <gasps> I was wondering what 
that sound rolls in apparently it's these guys going through the door. Oh my gosh. That's actually pretty funny. Okay, let's uh let's see how I do on this hard difficulty level of the paranormal investigation career. Knock on door. Okay, let's go take a look around. Get rid of these. Okay. Let's take. Interaction that would be like yell at or get angry at ghosts. How many people live in this house? Oh, I'm almost out of time to get rid of all these things. I wonder if, um, oh my. She's just scared to get near it. terrified to sleep because you're being haunted. Hmm, I'm gonna go down a little. Let me get up. Let's see from here. Anyway, um, that was a little confusing, not gonna lie, um, I got rid of all the ghosts, yet it hardly did anything, um, but overall I'm gonna, now I'm gonna give you, like, my, um, my actual feedback and my thoughts on, on this, um, so, I guess... I think, um, hang on. So, when you first come into the, to the creative sim, and there's no actual asp aspiration for, um, life aspirations for the sims. There's no life aspirations for the sims. And, um, it just, it's really confusing because, you know, this is supposed to be a pack, and especially because there is a career connected to this, yet, you can't have an aspiration connected to it. I had to pick an, a different aspiration that would be something else. And it just doesn't make any sense. So, um, yeah. And then it really honestly seems like the Sims get afraid for no reason. Um, yeah, they just, I mean, Sometimes, occasionally, there is a little sprite that comes along, a uh, little ghost, and he does, like, scare them or whatever, and you can talk to them occasionally. <laughs> sometimes you can talk to them, and sometimes they get really angry. Um, but, 
they just seem to get afraid for no reason. Like, there's no <laughs> sounds, there's no ghosts. Uh -huh. And, like, right now, my sim is terrified. Like, it's just, yeah, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, but what I really do like is, like, the detail that goes into this. These little things, they, they add, um, spookiness and that kind of thing to the lot. And it actually helps the lot to be a bit more, um spooky i guess i i like that a lot i i really like the animations that went into it as well and the hands like those little glowy hands things i don't this one like this that's pretty cool i like that <laughs> and my last thing is that when you have the interaction with the angry ghosts um oh, when i was at that last really super difficult um house trying to get rid of those ghosts and do that um paranormal uh what's it called paranormal investigator sorry um that you were still asking the uh ghost to leave and there's just it's just so plain like you only have one option and it's just to ask them to leave and um they obviously didn't leave a lot of them and that's what makes it so hard but I wish that they would have different options so like you could maybe yell at ghosts and like furiously <laughs> tell ghosts to leave I don't know something a little bit more um, standoffish I guess you could say so that you could stand up for yourself and that in turn then the ghost would be able to like angry at you and that kind of thing just add a bit more emotion to it and um or you could like scaredly ask ghosts to leave like um you could be terrified to ask the ghost to leave but it would do it and then afterwards if the ghost said no this sim would become a lot more scared um i i just think that it would add more <laughs> realism <laughs> as real as this can be um yeah, but Precise. overall, I thought this was a pretty good pack, especially, I thought it was worth the money, um, I'm, I liked it, um, I'd say it was worth my money, um, uh, I just, um, I mean, obviously it's at the beginning, but I would also like to see a bit more expansion on this so that when you get to higher levels there's other things you can do um i do wish that you could summon godry i wish you could summon godry you could summon godry and then it has a cooldown like von hilda so that they're not yeah, calling them Nobby. every single time and being able to be calmed down every single time um i haven't actually used godry to make my sims less scared of being in the house and also i'm not sure what kind of preservatives you guys put in your fruit cake but this has been sitting here for like a long time <laughs> it's been sitting here for i don't know like five days and it still hasn't gone bad so i'm not sure what you guys put in your fruit cake but i wouldn't eat it <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, I really enjoy this. Um, I'm so glad that I can share this with you. If you would like to share this with your friends or like, comment down below, go ahead, feel free, please do. See you later.